るとは思えないこれは But there's only one cure. We need to finish what we started. Seems the gods recommended this place to all their friends. Now all we need is one last shard. The sanctuary. If we can build, we can rebuild. The Ura swooped down from the east. At least now we know the way. Oh. Maybe I should have swapped my weapon. One last shard. It's all we need to put this mess behind us. Because it seems to be kicking. And mother, what a mess it is. My ass more than the enemy's. A mess like that could have only been made by hand. Zolf said the calamity failed. And he's right. The Ura stand as living proof of that. At the heart of the calamity was a simple idea. We never wanted to go to war again. Wanted to rule it out. We put a lot of folks against that problem. Scientists, soldiers, spies, even me. We traveled near as far as the kids go right now. Yep. Why did it turn around? <clears throat> Most of our efforts didn't bear fruit. Then there was a breakthrough, but it didn't come from one of our people. It came from an era, a brilliant young scientist named Ven. Ven worked for the Mansers, the sharpest knives in the city's drawer. With his help, the Mansers devised a way to seal the Ura tunnels shut in a flash. Just like that, every last Ura living in the Tassel terminals will be gone. This discovery was never to be used, they said, except as a last resort. Ven didn't like being manipulated. He had plans of his own. He sabotaged the Mansers' little science project, set it to blow up in their faces. Imagine how Ven must have felt when they finally made him pull that trigger. Everything. We just need that shard. 
actually kill this guy. He's supposed to just hit you. For the sake of story. Too bad the Ura ain't exactly been willing to collaborate on that front. Ah! I hate these things so much. Strange. Feels like I told this part a thousand times. Now you've only told it four times so far. First things first, though. There's someone we figured needed rescuing. See ya. The Ura fell back. No doubt planning the next move. But we knew ours already. Location unknown. Actually, check something. Do I have this upgraded? When one type of firepower ain't enough, there's always the carbine and the bellows. A lot of things need fixing up in this world, and we can start right here. Ignore armor. I might actually use this. There's something we had to do before going after that last shard. It is an awesome weapon. Well, now it's personal, ain't it? It's personal for him, and it's personal for me. Just he gets his hands on the care damage. package I sent him. So looks like I'm getting this back in. It's a little something I've been fixing up in my spare time. I forgot you need to take these things out. What else are you shooting at? The Ura found a way to keep the calamity from spreading through Sultan's Hollow. They got their own security and everything. Pretty fancy, even. Still, they ain't used to having visitors around. They've got these conductors that are all what's keeping the place together. Those rocks are like tumors, the same kind they are a plant in the bastion. Why does it point the other way? Well, the Ura must be in a panic right about now. Actually, I might just go with the musket, because it's nice at close range. And those guys will Kids like to get close range. Calamity's power for now. But the Ura ain't finished. They even sick their little rattletail pets on the kid. Those rodents are just a bump in the road. Okay, the musk isn't treating me as nice. That worked. Apart, piece by piece. Oh, hidden. By now, every Ura from here to the terminals must know he's in town. Most of the Ura's conductors are squared away in the middle of the hollow.
Those calamity rocks must be eating that place apart from the inside. Dora, ah. keep hanging on to that barricade. After all, their homeland's not much farther. Go away. Money. Sure. Sure. No. Uh -oh. Maybe they know they've lost this. Lost to a kid. They underestimated us. Had us pegged all wrong. Yes, our people caused the calamity, but here we are trying to fix it. That makes us different from our people now, don't it? Suppose old Zolf should have got to know us better. What if you had two melee weapons equipped? Would you not be able to get through this, like, entire level? Maybe I should have trusted him. Told him everything I knew. As the hour grows desperate, the Ura bring out their big guns. Aww. There's nothing standing in his way no more. There's a dialogue choice. He sees I guess. the Tazzle terminals loom large on the horizon. If you have the Calamity Cannon, he's like, but our guns are bigger. Wow, I'm... <laughs> that was intentional. Way out there on the edge of the world. That's where he finally finds you. But it ain't like Prosper Bluff this time. Ain't nothing for this gal to sing about now. I have your little harp thing. Why do you have another? Zia, you weren't kidnapped. No, ma'am. You just had to see what happened to the Ura. To your own people. You had to see if everything Zolf wrote to you was true. Why am I here? Part of the rippling walls floated by, so I caught the kid's old knapsack. Oh. No, I, I will not. Not yet. So yeah, musket not working so good. Cannon, awesome damage. Carbine. Almost as much damage, but not quite. Pistols. I think they break through armor too, but... I don't know if they'd be too helpful against these guys. I'll give it a shot. Wouldn't have thought to bring a bellows to a shootout, but it just might work. I don't need to see what happened to the Ura. I'm trying to undo it, remember? Okay. Sure you didn't drop that twangy thing on purpose, just to see if he go after you. They lost everything, didn't they? But they just keep on fighting like that's gonna bring it all back. Once the kid gets that last shard from Zolf, it'll all be over. The final level. I can't hear him at all anymore. He's too far away. 